हेलो स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज स्वाति देश पांडे टीचर टूडे विल बी कवरिंग वन मोर इम्पॉर्टेंट चैप्टर फ्रॉम एट स्टैंडर्ड स्कॉलरशिप द नेम ऑफ द चैप्टर इज ये पेरीमीटर सी स्टूडेंट यू हैव लर्न पेरीमीटर इन फिफ्थ स्टैंडर्ड सो आई एम श्योर एवरीबडी नोज वॉट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ पेरीमीटर जस्ट इन सिंपल वर्ड्स पेरीमीटर मीन्स द आउटर बॉर्डर ऑफ एनी पर्टिक्युलर फिगर ओके while taking into consideration the perimeter we are supposed to ignore whatever lines are there inside only the outer border okay chalo start karte hain let's go ahead with few important sums okay the first sum will appear on your screen the square of side 12 cm is cut on the diagonal find the perimeter of one triangle so formed if this is a square With side twelve centimeter, all sides are twelve centimeter. This is cut here, the diagonal. How much will be the diagonal? Diagonal will be twelve root two. You should know this. If the side is x, the diagonal of the square will be x root two. I am using that property of a square. Okay. Once you know this, job is easy. first we need to find out the perimeter of this square perimeter of the square that is 12 into 4 that is 48 cm and perimeter of a triangle is i am writing here 12 plus 12 plus 12 root 2 12 plus 12 plus 12 root 2. I can add this 24 plus 12 root 2. Right? Or I can write this as 12 into 2. Then also it is okay. So this is one. This is another one. Out of that 12 I can remove. Common. This may be 12. This may be 12. So I am remo removing it out. So two plus root two will remain here. Okay. If earlier how I had written twenty four plus twelve root two, then also you can do. Here it is twenty four. Here it is twelve. So twelve I can remove. Twenty four is twelve into two. So twelve I am removing. So inside only two will remain. And here, so anyway answer won't change. Here it is centimeter. 12 into bracket 12, 2 plus root 2 cm. Very very easy. Only thing is you should know this. If side is x, then diagonal of a square is x root 2. That's it. Let's go ahead. Next sum will appear on your screen. The radius of a semicircular garden is 28 meter. How much more distance? Has one to cover for going from A to B on the circular path instead of going to diametrical path. Here they have given options as one seven point two meter, second one thirty two meter, third one zero point thirty two hectometer, and fourth one. 320 cm let's begin what is their question if a wants to go to b from here to here on the diameter how much distance will it cover and another one if a travels like this on a circular path how much distance will it cover okay so we need to find out the difference between both the distances so let's start this is very simple if radius is 28 meter this is also 28 meter entire diameter will be diameter will be 28 into 2 or 28 plus 28 so 56 meter if a goes like this on the diametrical path it has to cover 56 meters if it goes like this on the circular path then what this is circumference half half the circumference 
So what is the formula of a circumference 2 pi r? But we don't want entire cir uh, circular path. We want only half. So half of it. So only pi r we need. Let's go ahead. Pi is 22 upon 7. R is 28. They have mentioned here. So let's do it. It is 88 meter. If it goes from A to B on the circular path, it has to cover 88 meters. So obviously difference is 88 minus 56. So 32 meter is the answer. But here we are supposed to choose two correct options. So one is very clear here. Which one is the other one? See, you all know the relationship of uh, meter, decameter, hectometer, kilometer and so on. If you don't know students, let me know. I will make a small video on that. There is a uh, table which shows various relationships of various units. Okay. Hectometer is meter upon 100. So this is meter. So 32 ko agar hum log 100 se divide karte hai, then it is converted into hectometer. So which is equal to 0 0.32 hectometer, which is our option 3. So these two, means 32 meter is same as 0 0.32 hectometer. Their value is same, only the unit differs. Okay? Chalo, aage badte hai. Students read the sum. A circle of area 314 cm square is inscribed in a square. What is the perimeter of this square? See, I have drawn the figure already. Students here, they have given area of circle which is equal to 314 cm square. Here you are supposed to know when a circle is inscribed in a square. The diameter of the circle is same as the side of the square. So here we are going to make use of this area and the formula of area to find out the radius of the circle. Once we know the radius, we will know the diameter. Once we know the diameter, we will know the side of the square. And then finding out the perimeter is so easy. Isn't it? What is the formula of area of a circle? Pi r square. So pi r square is 314. Here they have mentioned you are supposed to take pi as 3.14 and not 22 upon 7. Okay, fair enough. 3.14 r square is equal to 314. 314, we will this write in the form of fraction. So that it becomes easy. So R square is 314 and this entire thing I am going to take it that side. So reciprocal of the same. This 100 will go up and 314 will come down. Very easy now. So R square is 100. So R is equal to 10 centimeter. This is the radius. We have got this as 10 centimeter. So radius will be 20 centimeter. If radius is 20 centimeter, side will be, side of the square will be 20 centimeter. Side of square is 20 centimeter, then perimeter of a square, so easy. 4 into side, that is 4 into 20. That is 80 centimeter. This is our answer. So easy. Isn't it? Easy. Just one principle. Inscribed circle. So, uska diameter will be same as the side of the outer square. If you know this, this sum is very easy. Right? Students read the next sum. How many revolutions will the wheel of a bicycle make to cover a distance of 4.4 km if its diameter is 70 cm? They have given the diameter of a bicycle. Wheel. Right? Wheel of the bicycle has a diameter 70 cm. 
See, when it is a question of revolution, how many revolutions means it is a sum of perimeters. So easy, right? So here they have given total distance as 4.4 kilometers and uh, diameter of a wheel of a bicycle is 70 centimeter. So I suggest you first convert this into centimeter because one is kilometer, other one is centimeter. No, first let's convert. This is 4400 meter and meter to centimeter again two zeros. See you can keep numbers as 4.4 in 2000 in 200 instead of multiplying. You can keep it like that. But now first we will have to find out the circumference of the wheel because circumference of the wheel is equal to the one round or one revolution. Okay. So let's find out the circumference of the wheel. Circumference of a circle is 2 pi r. See, 70 is the diameter. So obviously radius will be 35 centimeter, right? Half of it. So that is r. Pi, we know. 22 upon 7. So let's do it. 44 into 5. That is 220 centimeter is the circumference of a V. Now remember students, total distance upon circumference is equal to total revolutions. Remember this. So we are going to use this. Total distance is this. 4,40,000 upon circumference is 220 will divide 22 ones are 22 twos are and this three zeros so total revolutions are 2000 so simple one small formula of circumference and this another very very small formula we have got two marks so easy Questions are going to be very very straightforward based on formula. So please see all the formula of perimeter. Right? We are supposed to know various uh, formula of various different types of figures. Square, rectangle and many other. Okay? So if you know this, circumference of a uh, circle is same as the perimeter of the circle. Okay? It has got a different name. That's it. Right? Chal, aage badte. Students read the next sum. The perimeter of a semicircle is 108 centimeter. What is the perimeter of the square drawn on the diameter of the semicircle? This is the semicircle. The perimeter of this is 108. And then we need to find out the uh, perimeter of this square which is based on or drawn on this diameter. What does it mean? The side of that square is same as the diameter of this semicircle. So let's make use of this number or value which they have given in the sum. 108. What is that? Perimeter of a semicircle. What is the formula of a perimeter of the semicircle or circumference of the semicircle? It is one and the same thing. It is pi r plus d that is diameter okay or this you are supposed to write like this if you are using small letter here okay for radius or pi r plus 2 r diameter means 2 times radius so now we are going to make use of this formula pi r plus 2 r that is 22 upon 7 r plus 2 r now R, R we can take it out as common inside it will remain 22 upon 7 plus 2 
that is R22 plus, now here denominator is 1, so we are finding out basically the LCM of 1 and 7. We are making the denominators equal. So it is like this, which is same as 36 upon 7. Okay, so this is the formula of the perimeter of a semicircle. Instead of using this or this, you can use this. This is relatively easy. Okay. So R into 36 upon 7 is equal to 108, which they have given in the sum. So let's find out value of R. It will be 108 into 7 upon 36. We can do with small numbers, but I am doing it right away into 3. So 21. R is 21. Once we know R, 21. We This is also 21. So diameter will be 21 into 2, that is 42 which is going to be the side of a square. Once you know the side of a square, how to find out the perimeter? Perimeter of square is equal to 4 into side, that is 4 into 42, that is 168. 168 is the answer. So easy. Everything is in centimeter, so this also will be centimeter. Very easy. Let's go ahead. Let's read the next sum. The length of a rectangular garden is 5 upon 4 times its breadth. The expenditure for 4 layered wiring around the garden at rupees 36 per meter is rupees 1,29,600. What is the breadth of the garden? Okay, garden is rectangular. Length is 5 upon 4 times the breadth. So, if this is x, this is 5 upon 4x. That's what they have said. And they want to do the wiring around the border. So, obviously this is the sum of perimeter. And they want to do 4 layers, so 4 times perimeter, 4 times perimeter, if we find out, then we will know the total wire required, then into 36, because 36 is the rate, then total expenditure is 1,29,600. So, we have to go backwards in this case, total cost is, 1,29,600. What is the rate? Rate is rupees 36. So, total wire required, how can you find out? Total cost upon rate. So, that is 1,29,600 upon 36. Let's do it. 12 threes are, 12 ones are. Then please don't forget to write 0 here because 9 is alone. 9 se kuch kaam nahi hota hai. So 0, then it becomes 96. 8s are and then these two zeros. Then 3 ones are, 3 threes are, 3 six are and these two zeros. So total wire required is 3600 meter. Okay. Now, why so much wire is required? Because they want to layer 4 times. So, this is equal to 4 times perimeter. 4 into perimeter. 1 round is perimeter. So, if you want to find out the perimeter, how to do that? 3600 divided by 4. That is 900 meter. So, 900 meter is the perimeter. Now we know the perimeter. Now our job is very easy. We know the length, we know the breadth. Let's find out. How to find out the perimeter? 2 times 
length plus breadth right so that is equal to 900 so if you want you can take this two here down division or you can multiply with this answer won't change so i am keeping it right, like this only this is upon 1 so i need to make this also 4 so 4x plus 4x upon 4 that is equal to 900 i have done this into 4 into 4 okay so here it is 2 into 9x upon 4 here you can do division that is equal to 900 so 9x upon 2 what is remaining 9x upon 2 that is equal to 900 so x is 900 ye 2 upar jayega 9 niche aayega dividing by 1000. So 2 upon 10 is same as 0 0.2 kilometers. So option 4 is same as option 2. So correct here options are 2 and 4. Here also we have used very simple formulae this one and perimeter. So perimeter is such a topic which is based on formula. So our job is very simple because questions are going to be very very simple and straightforward. Okay, once you know the concept properly and formula, then your job is very easy. In case you enjoy my videos, then please share them with more and more students. And in case you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please do that. I will come with the next video very very soon. Till then, study well and very important thing is, I know you all know by now, but still I want to tell you, Enjoy studying. Bye.